how you doing class uh y'all get to see my star wars collection but that's not why we're here today so what i learned this semester was how easy it is to be labeled um a mental disorder that you may or may not have um and how easy it is to potentially misdiagnose someone that being said, that's the majority of, you know, I, I know I learned a lot more this semester, but that's my big takeaway from it. Um, I say that because with like my experience with mental health and everybody else's um, that might be going through it, they may diagnose you as one thing, even though that you're showing a lot of signs of something else. And when you do the research and you understand what they diagnosed you as, you've come to find out that that's not... That's not what you may or may not have. I think a lot of people are misdiagnosing people nowadays with mental health disorders. So that's why I think that that's a big thing that I, you know, I learned and I feel like that hopefully will get fixed. Um, I also, it was also great because we learned a lot more stuff. We learned about like, I loved learning how to track my time, even though I do feel like I will never accurately be able to stick to a schedule due to the fact that, you know, my schedule is constantly changing and updating. It's very hard when you work in retail to know when they're going to need you, when they're going to want you, what time frames you're set. Um, so when we did that and we tracked our time and made a schedule, I don't think I could stick to it because of that. We learned about the brain, which I thought was really freaking cool. The brain was an awesome, um, an awesome thing because, you know, we need it every day, can do basic stuff, but the brain can also turn on itself, which can cause a lot of these mental or this d mental disabilities or mental problems. Um, and we also learned about the psychology of stress. The psychology of stress, you know, it affects people, it can hurt people, and if you have too much of it, it can be a bad thing, but some stress can also be a good thing. So we went over all of that as a class. Um, we also just we also went over how uh, how anxiety and substance abuse are terrible terrible things, and how people would need help on them in order for them to get help with that. It can be a you know a great thing to get help. Um, so how it has personally benefited me uh, because I learned a lot more about myself and a lot more about what my disability, uh, mental trauma and everything is. I shouldn't say mental disability, but some people have it, but I learned that it, I think it'll help me further study and be able to help myself more on how to find therapeutic ways to help myself because I don't believe in medication because I've been on medication since I've been, um, six maybe even younger than that and every time i either got angrier or i got suicidal and i'm not i'm not okay with that and i feel like everybody's brain chemistry is different that is why it cannot help you and could eventually hurt someone but that's that's how it's personally benefited beneficial to me is i feel like i can take it into the real world and i can help others with it you know i might meet a kid with um I, I think it helped me with my buddy Zion. He actually, while I was doing this course, he was going through um, alcohol, uh, substance abuse, and it was causing him psychological trauma. And he was, when he would drink too much, he wouldn't be mentally there and he would just snap. And then he would think that what people told him he did while he was drunk never happened. And I felt really concerned when that was going on. And I wanted to help him, and I think when we were talking about that course, and I was able to help him. He's actually doing better now. He's a lot sober. We had a, you know, he's sober now. He doesn't drink. We had a cock about it, and that's how this course was able to help me help someone else, which is really great. Um, it was uh, this course was also personally beneficial because it helped me understand the human brain better. Like I said, we learned about it and how different parts of the brain can be affected by stress, by trauma. Um, trauma sucks, trust me, I know I lost, um, two people tragically, like, and I'm talking brutally, um, but that's a story for another time, I guess. Uh, so, I know what it's like to suffer through trauma, and, like I said, I know, I'm here for anyone who needs help, by the way, if you don't want to open up to an adult, and you want to open up to somebody who won't report you to the police, um, you know, you guys have me as a resource, never forget that, because I know what it's like, and I'll always be here to help. So I think that's another thing that this course helped me do is it's going to help me 
be a resource to people, reach out, help, because I know what it's like to live through some of this stuff. And I don't want anybody to suffer alone because I know what suffering with your thoughts can feel like. And it's it's not fun, especially when you're down your luck or things aren't going your way. But yeah, so I'm I'm always here if anyone needs it. And, but yeah, so I hope you all did good in this course. And the teacher was very understanding and helped me grasp a lot of these concepts. Um, like I said, I've done prior research before taking this class, but this class gave me a better and deeper understanding of mental psychology and how I, you know, it even kind of, no disrespect to anybody, I don't know if she was trying to do this, but it kind of confirmed my belief that medication is just kind of a joke and it can't always cure everything and it might not even cure most people because everybody's brain chemistry is different so the medication would affect you differently no matter what in my opinion so yeah thank you guys all and thank you teach and i will um hopefully i'll see you all around